really from that V8 on up, up until uh, tassel time frame. During that time frame, the corn plant's gonna take up about 60% of its total nitrogen uptake for the season. Hi, and welcome back to another agronomy update here in North Central Iowa. I'm Phil Long, regional agronomist here with Liquid Grow. Today, talking about your side dress nitrogen application. In the field today, looking at some corn, this early planted stuff, a lot of what we've seen in our area is already at that V1, V2 stage. That's where this is, this is at, just hasn't quite popped that second collar. But we're coming up quick on a time that's really critical for nitrogen uptake in corn, and that's V4. Uh, if we look at GDUs and use that to calculate out, we can see we're about 22 to 24 days from emergence to V4. So why is V4 so important? Because really, that's when we wanna start side dressing that nitrogen so that it has time to get to the roots, really from that V8 on up until uh, tassel time frame. During that time frame, the corn plant's gonna take up about 60% of its total nitrogen uptake for the season. So depending on how big a crop that is, that's quite a bit. It's taken up between four and eight pounds per day as it grows from that 12 inch tall stage to about 12 feet tall. Uh, so really a critical time for nitrogen uptake. When you're side dress, uh, applying nitrogen, you're allowing the efficiency of that fertilizer in terms of timing, you're getting it there at the right time when the crop needs it. That's why we're stressing the V4 time frame because you want to have it out there uh, before the crop really starts to take it up. In case there is a shortage of nitrogen, you'll have it there in time. Now, let's talk a little bit in terms of placement too. I'm out here in front of a, your old typical Coulter side dress machine, which usually goes straight down the middle of the row. Obviously, you can move these one way or another uh, to alter exactly where that, that band is getting injected into. Uh, but Placement is, is also important because as you think that corn plant is going to shoot roots off at about a 30 degree angle depending on the hybrid, uh, that's typically what they do and obviously depending on soil conditions, compaction and so forth. So uh, it's not going to be right in the middle of the row. It takes corn a little while to get roots all the way across the 30 inch row and a lot of times they don't ever just search for it on the top. So the second part of this equation is obviously moisture and during that critical peak demand Corn can be taken up what, even over a quarter of an inch a, a rain per acre per day uh, of water. And that coincides with the nitrogen because the nitrogen moves into the plant uh, through mass flow with, with the water. So water is a critical part of this, but we can help this out by placing it differently. So in the middle of the row obviously requires a little more nitrogen to get out to the root system. As long as we have normal moisture like we typically do, that's usually not a problem. If we're short on moisture, that's where something like a Y drop or, or something can be really advantageous. There's even these, these side dress machines nowadays come with a dual placement, uh, they call it, uh, or a Coulter plus kind of a, a Y drop kind of feature where it gets it out right next to the row. And that's key because especially as the corn plant gets taller, it funnels that moisture right down along the base of the root system. It's very good at doing that even with light rains and dews. So keeps that moisture in there, keeps the water, the nitrogen moving uh, with the water. So that's something to keep in mind. The other thing I wanna point out on side dress is don't wait too late. Now this does take into account the hybrid that you're using and it, how it utilizes nitrogen, which is getting a little, little deep, but uh, that's very important, especially if you're gonna be placing nitrogen later in the season. Remember, moisture later in the season is usually harder to come by. Uh, so that Y drop placement would, would be superior in that case. But just remember, the peak time, the peak uptake, 60% of that total nitrogen is taken up by the time it hits tassel. So you want to have it out there when it really needs it the most. And depending on how much you put up front, you may want to start earlier. So hopefully these tips help you out a little bit here this, this year as you get started in your side dress nitrogen applications. Feel free to reach out to us with any other questions you have. Thanks for watching. Stay in the know with Legal Grow.